five minute Marvel stories. Marvel, the mighty Thor, a brother's battle. When they were younger, Thor and Loki, the two princes of Asgard, were inseparable. But as they grew older, the brothers grew apart. And when Loki heard Thor was next in line for the throne of Asgard, he knew he should be happy for his brother. But all Loki could feel was incredible jealousy. Loki disliked how Thor hogged the spotlight by showing off his powers and strength. I have amazing powers too, Loki thought. Loki was an expert at magic and playing tricks on the mind something Thor found irritating as they grew older. Suddenly, Loki felt a horrible urge to crush Thor. He gasped at the thought of this. He did not want to hurt his brother, yet he had a stronger desire to be king. Loki planned to trap Thor on the Isle of Silence where no one would find him. Loki would lure his brother there by tricking Thor into rescuing him. With his brother gone, Loki would be the next in line for the throne. Loki was pleased with his selfish plot. Meanwhile, Thor was on Earth as Dr. Don Blake. Even though he was galaxies away, he was still connected to Asgard, so connected that he could hear Loki's cry for help. Loki was stranded on the Isle of Silence. Donald Blake immediately transformed into the mighty Thor to save his brother. Little did he know he was falling right into Loki's trap. Thor rushed over the rainbow bridge to the Isle of Silence. When he arrived, he did not see his brother. Worried about Loki, Thor didn't notice the silent ones. Trolls who lived below ground on the isle emerging from the soil. Suddenly, the ground shook. Thor tried to gain his balance as the surface broke into millions of pieces as the trolls grabbed at him. Then Loki appeared. Brother, so glad you made it. Loki cackled. Thor realized it was a trick. All the trolls attacked Thor at once. They were huge, at least twice the size of Thor. They pulled him underground, trying to take him captive, as Loki had promised they could. Struggling, Thor wrestled with the trolls. Loki watched Thor's doom with a satisfied smirk. Excited, he raced back to Asgard to claim his spot as the heir to the throne. Thor had fought many creatures, monsters, and beasts before. But these trolls were big and strong, just like him. His only chance to beat them 
was with Mjolnir, as he struck his mighty hammer against the ground, bolts of lightning shot out from every direction. As the lightning hit the silent ones, the trolls screeched in pain and instantly buried themselves underground. Once the silent ones were defeated, Thor noticed Loki was already gone. Flying above the Bifrost, Thor searched for the trickster. Minutes later, he spotted Loki. Effortlessly, Thor plucked him from the Bifrost and flew back to the Isle of Silence. This time, the Silent Ones did not come out. They knew better than to bother Thor. They would be satisfied with Loki as their prisoner. Why did you bring me back here? Loki asked, confused. Thor held Loki's collar tight. He did not trust Loki. I risked my life to save you, only for you to betray me. Why would you do this? Thor asked. Loki only flashed a mischievous grin. Thor could not imagine what else this trickster was up to. You are a prisoner here, Loki. You can return to Asgard when you're ready to be my brother again, Thor said. But Loki was already back to his old ways. Loki used his magic to make it seem like there were dozens of him. Thor had had enough of his brother's games. With a mighty swing of Mjolnir, Thor knocked out all the illusions until only one was left, the real Loki, who was surprised by Thor's outburst. Tell me why you did this, Loki, Thor demanded. But Loki gave no response. Thor gave Loki a stern look before he left him alone to think about his actions. Thor felt hurt by what Loki had done, but he hoped that one day they could again be the brothers they used to be. He missed his brother. With a heavy heart, Thor spun his mighty hammer and flew off toward the Bifrost. This is the perfect place to plot my next plan. Loki said under his breath as he watched Thor depart. Loki was no longer the brother Thor knew. He had turned mad with jealousy and greed. He has forsaken love and friendship for the promise of power. As Thor disappeared into the sky, Loki let out an evil snicker. Watch out, brother. I'll return for my revenge and my throne.